You know, it isn't just architecture. It's 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 kind of like it's really an experience. Well, it's a it, feeling. It is an experience. It's what I think of as a symphony of light, form, and the manipulation of space, which are the basic ingredients of superior architecture. There's so much motion going on here. There is a lot of lively motion, and it was designed to do that. What we wanted to do is create an experience where there is a festivity of, of things happening, water, light, plants, yeah. uh, to really invite the people in to this space. Tell us about the, uh, the actual building of a space like this. The well, it was, we wanted, it was dedicated to the public, uh, a certain amount of the area, and in exchange for that dedication, Mr. Trump got some additional floor area in the tower. Mm -hmm. But we had to provide a certain number of plants and a certain uh, square footage requirement. Uh, we have entertainment, piano. And the whole reason for making this is to really create something very special. We have in this, in this uh, atrium some of the world's most famous shops like Bonwit Teller, and Cartier, and Charles Jordan, and mm -hmm. Wavy. And when you have those kinds of very special shops, you have to create an environment that is going to attract the customer. Yeah. And so we chose marble and brass and mirrors uh, so that we create reflections and, and have things that, that make this a really exciting place to come to. Mm -hmm. The waterfall behind you is absolutely stunning. And I'm not sure that I've ever been in, in a space that had quite as much marble as we've got here. Well, the marble was very special. It comes from Verona, Italy. And I made several trips along with Mrs. Trump to select the actual right color. The water itself is an event. The ambient noise of water is one of the most relaxing things yeah. uh, for shopping, uh, for to, to, in this kind of an architectural experience that one can do. Dear, thanks a lot for your tour, and well, congratulations. I think you've done a fantastic job. It's been lots of fun. Thank you. We talked next to Ivana Trump, and she showed us her fabulously furnished model apartments. Well, Bob, this is one of our model apartments. What do you think? Very dramatic. <laughs> Thank Fantastic. you. Fantastic. Thank you. Why do you bother to have a model apartment at all? Well, as you know, the Trump Tower is 90% occupied, occupied and sold out. Mm -hmm. And you know that the model apartments usually are done as your selling tool. Yes. We did, want, we did feel that we own it to the people like you, media, newspaper, mm -hmm. our friends, or the clients, to show them or just bring the little suggestion how we would like to see the people live. How, or how people we, could live How here. people could live. This is a wonderful way to live, I suppose. What is all this? These walls are superb. It, it's a mural which was painted by the German artists. They were commissioned by us. And you can see the very beautiful workmanship, 24 carat gold. Yeah. And they spent two months from morning to evening to working on this. The perspective is really wonderful. It's Thank terrific. you. As we're coming to the room, you see the fire, which we used the mirror on the walls, which yeah. makes it much bigger than yeah. it really is. The very sophisticated stereo system. Media center, yeah. That's right. It's beautiful. The desk in here, when you can work, yeah. you can read. Everything is highly beautiful, glossed, beautiful lacquer, lacquer work, work and custom and design. And you have the little uh, breakfast yeah. area, lunch, dinner, it's cocktails, your setting, whatever, cocktails. Yeah. Yeah, then we're coming into the living area. This is a really okay. deluxe. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Well, as you can see, the, we put the mirrors on the wall for the people which are sitting the backwards to the city, which really cannot see the beauty and the skyline on the mm -hmm. city. Yeah. It reflects in the mirror in front of me. So you have a magnificent view, so am I. <laughs> and I feel very underdressed for this apartment. I feel like I should have black tie on. Uh, was that intentional, the, the, that feeling in, in here with the decor? Well, the Trump Tower, it's all black tie, uh. <laughs> as you can see. Or our clientele are black tie people. They're mm -hmm. very, very um, wealthy people, mm -hmm. sophisticated people. And this is the feel which they like, enjoy, or feel comfortable in. Mm -hmm. Wonderful space. What did you do Thank for you. the bedroom? Well, I would like to show you, as dramatic as this space is, yeah. the bedroom, it's very soft and it's feminine. The woman is going to feel wonderful there. Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah. Yes, it's totally okay. different in feeling. It's completely different feeling. You can relax in here. Ah. All the materials, the silks, satins, soft colors, you know, beautiful lacquer work. Incredible lacquer work, yeah. Thank you. Looks like everything in here is custom designed for this room. Yeah, it was done by the Michael DeSantis, the New York designer, and everything was done on the paper, custom designed to fit this room. 
Earlier we looked at an unfinished bathroom. I'd yeah. love to take a look at the, the, the decorated bathroom over here. Well, in the bathroom you can see that you can do a lot of things with the decoration, with the wallpaper. You can mm -hmm. do it very quiet with the beige, beige wallpaper on the walls. Or you can play it sophisticated with the black background. Mm -hmm. It's still soft enough with the flower on, 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 the, on the pattern. Mm -hmm. You can also, accessories are very, very important. Flowers. You know, little, little you can things, see little bit below, yeah. the towers, you know, very beautiful towers. The, the man and the woman are feeling very good in here. Yeah, it's a practical solution. But it, it's still, it's very high gloss. Did, did you think of making a model that would be more common, more daytime perhaps? Uh, if I may, I would love to show you one apartment which you have on the same floor, which is very family oriented. Oh, let's very take a quick soft. look. Thank you. Okay. Oh yeah, totally different feeling in here. That's right. This is our two-bedroom apartment, and it's very family-oriented, mm -hmm. very quiet. We are using the mirrors on the wall, still a little bit of the mirrors. But as you but can less see, so, yeah. and you coming in here, we are using the uh, materials, fabrics on the walls. And uh, Ivana, this is silk, isn't it? Yes, it is. <laughs> it's wonderful. <laughs> nice. In here, you can see our dining area. You can sit down eight people for the dinner. Uh huh. And it's just very beautiful Lacker. space in here. Yeah. Lockers. You come in here and you see the divider with the buffet table mm -hmm. between your living area mm -hmm. and your dining area. Mm -hmm. And as you're coming in here, you can see the beautiful comfort, soft fabrics, very rich 100 fabrics, yeah. wools. Tell me about these tables. This is uh, uh, these tables are. You can see that there's a lot of detail involved. You have the brass base. Yeah. Then you have a reveals, lacquer yeah. work, and then finally, you know, our showpiece, which are Italian imported onyx which is one of the most expensive stones you can get on the market these days. That's, uh, they're absolutely and beautiful. That's right. And, and again, they, they it's very, very blend, light, yeah. quiet. All the colors are earth colors, which we all came from, mm -hmm. brown, beige. Everybody loves it. Yeah. Everybody loves it. Now, we're in one corner here, and then we have yeah. two more corners within this apartment. That's to look right. At, don't we? I would like to show you the den, which is the second bedroom of this apartment. Mm -hmm. Oh, yes. And again, different feel, natural woods, brown and beige. Very comfortable. Again, a little bit. Very comfortable looking, yeah. I you love can, this. It's a Carl Springer table. It's a beautiful table. Wonderful. And again, in here you can, you can it, this space can be used as a library, mm -hmm. working area, you can work from here. Or you can watch your television, very sophisticated stereo mm -hmm. system television. Or you can open the sofa which you're sitting on and it converts to the bed in case that you have a visitors or the children which can come mm -hmm. for the weekend and see you. So this is our second second bedroom. Very comfortable. And uh, I would like to ask, show you our master bedroom. Mm -hmm. It's our magnificent views. Oh. Mm. Again, very, very soft. Like a gold box here. <laughs> yes, as you can see, the views are just spectacular. You can see the crown building with the gold leaf, yes. which is very much of the scheme of our room. Yes, a beautiful got a lot of gold Swiss in here. <laughs> fabric. In here, you have a window seat, when you can just lie down or sit down and enjoy your beautiful views. Uh, on a built-up ledge. You have a little build-up platform with the television set on it. You're lying on the bed, watching your television, or just enjoying again your views. This custom yeah. furniture is really it's something all else. Thank you. I love the way you've placed the bed uh, at an angle within the room. As you can see, again, it's in the angle because you want to have the most of your views. Mm -hmm. You see, you have the both windows and you see outside. And this space can be used. You're lying on the bed watching your television. Your wife can be in here. Using this cabinet. Using this cabinet for the makeup, answering the mail, for the reading, doesn't disturb the partner. Yes, yes. In it's a very practical have, piece. Yeah, you have a closet and the bathroom right near to it. Make calls all around the world on you your own You can call up the whole world, yes. Not bad. Thank well, you. Dear Scott gave us a, a very good idea of the design of the outside of this building, and uh, he's done a smashing job. But the interiors, I understand, are largely your responsibility. You pick most of the color schemes and many of the fabrics and so forth, right? Thank you so much. Yes, You've I done pick, a fantastic job. Yeah, pick the designers and, and work up very closely with them to get a feel which you did want to achieve. Well, congratulations, Mrs. Trump, and thank, thank you. you for the tour. Thank you so much. Believe it or not, the cost of furnishing one of these apartments is somewhere around a quarter million dollars. Silk and satin does not come cheap, folks. Meanwhile, back in the atrium, we caught up with entrepreneur Donald Trump. 
and asked him how the project developed. Donald, when did you first get the idea for the Trump Tower? We really had the idea about three years ago when we realized the site was available and we wanted to do something great. And this is really how it all came about. Oh, you really mm -hmm. have. What was the economic situation in New York back then? The economic situation for this location has always been great. Mm -hmm. In good times and bad times, Fifth Avenue and 57th Street has always really been very strong. Mm -hmm. But uh, generally, the economic conditions in the country at that time were not very good. So I guess you could say that we did take a risk, a chance. Mm -hmm. In a project of this magnitude, there must have been a lot of problems to deal with. But what was the single worst problem that you faced? Well, we didn't have problems, but when you're going to spend the kind of money that we've spent on a building where we spend for the finest marble, for the finest bronze, for the finest everything else, you have to be careful, to be perfectly honest, because it really does add to your risk. And we decided to go absolutely first class all the way, and it's something we're very happy that we did. Donald, now that you've completed the finest residential address in the world, perhaps, what do you do for an encore? I don't know. Well, maybe I'd love to do something else like it again, but I'll never be given the opportunity. We'll never be able to have this kind of a location, this kind of a place. So in the pure real estate sense, we'll never be able to do this again, but we'll try and find something. At a cost of about $1,000 per square foot, Trump Tower is really out of the reach of most of us. Do you think there can be such a thing as affordable, good design? I think yes, but I think it's very difficult. Without the help of the federal government today, I think it's very difficult. Getting good residential design and getting the kind of money when you're paying interest rates of 11, 12, 13 percent, it really makes it prohibitive. What pleases you most about the finished results? I think the acceptance of the public, the acceptance of the architectural community. The, we've gotten the greatest reviews given to a building in many, many years. But the acceptance generally of the public, the numbers of people that have come in and used Trump Tower, over the course of the last uh, year since it's been, you know, just starting to form and just starting to open. We're very happy with it. It's That's been incredibly well accepted. It's got to be a great thrill. Thanks for joining us, Donald.